Learning musical instruments using online instructional videos has become increasingly popular. However, learning with pre-recorded video does not provide immediate feedback as human tutors do, and existing video navigations are not optimized for instrument learning, making the learning experience encumbered. We present Soloist. A full stack framework using audio processing to automatically generate interactive tutorials from off the shelf music video lessons. To create a learning session, the user selects a video from YouTube. Soloist then processes the audio from the video to obtain the necessary information. That information, along with the video, is presented on a web interface for the user to interact with. The front-end interface consists of the tutorial video, waveform navigator, learning feedback, and learning progression. The waveform navigator visualizes the instructor's narration voice and instrument sound to help users locate where the guitar is being played. Soloist automatically segments the video into demonstration regions. Clicking on a region will play the specified interval. The user can drag the boundaries to refine the start and end of a region. Soloist also provides a set of navigational tools. Clicking on play to begin playback, loop to play a region repeatedly. User can also select different playback speeds, delete a region, or clear all presented regions. Clicking the preview button and hovering the cursor on different regions will display the melodic lines in the regions. Users can select the region and press the query button. Soloist will then display the regions containing similar melodies and hide the remaining ones. They can also click the connect button to play all the displayed regions. To rehearse along the region, Users can select it and click the record button. Soloist would then record and analyze users' performance to provide feedback. Soloist visualizes the melodic lines of both the user recording and the instructor's demonstration. Many common mistakes of guitar performance can be therefore identified. Users can play both their performance and the reference simultaneously by clicking the play results button. Mixing sliders allows users to adjust the relative volumes. Soloist also informs the correctness of the user's practice. To handle the inevitable uncertainties of the machine learning models we used, we adopted a mixed initiative design with which users can overwrite the score when they believe the assessment is not accurate. Lastly, Slowis tracks users' practice progress and uses the colors gray, yellow, and teal to represent three practice stages to learn, started, and aced. We conducted a technical evaluation on video segmentation. The results showed that our algorithm consistently outperforms the baseline across all metrics. Our qualitative study shows that Soloist addresses the pain points we identified in the interviews and literature. And the participants unanimously preferred learning with Soloist compared to using traditional YouTube videos. We hope our work will inspire future work on computer-aided music learning systems.